What is it? I have to get to a camp in the woods, occupied by people who are seriously ill. They need a healer. The area is overrun with bandits and Mongols. Yes, I'll need protection. I can get you there. But the sickness concerns me. You're sure you can fight it? Sickness isn't something you fight. It's something you have to care for. If the people are as ill as you say, we should leave now. Stop the sickness before it spreads. Thank you, my lord. How did you survive the battle at Komoda? It was thanks to a woman, Yuna. She rescued me from the beach, nursed me back to health. She sounds like a gifted healer. She's one of the bravest people I know. I wouldn't be here without her. My mother did the same for me. As a boy, I was always sick. But through her knowledge of herbs, she made me strong. She's the reason I'm a healer. Wait, I think I see something up ahead. Good eye. Stay back. Let me handle it. Where are you hiding? We don't have it. Are you cowards? We shouldn't be traveling here alone. We had to leave our farmstead, my lord. Everyone there is sick. What brought it on? Spirits. Our ancestors are punishing us. We gave the Mongols our food instead of fighting back. When they left, everyone grew ill. Now our home is cursed. There's an inn just down the road. You should be safe there. It's much too dangerous outside. Get indoors and stay there. Thank you. I only hope the spirits don't follow us. You're quite the butcher with that sword. What would you have done with the bandits? In my experience, firm but polite words go a long way. You have experience with bandits then? I. Just think one should try to resolve a problem peacefully before resorting to violence. Spoken like a healer. You chose the right occupation. Healer! Healer! Thank goodness 
You're here. Homeo, what is it? What's wrong? It's my son. I think he ate something poisonous. Take me to him. What about those suffering at the camp? We've already delayed. It will only take a moment. I'll help. Perhaps we can make this quick. Thank you, my lord. What did he eat? I wish I knew. We have no food. I'll see if I can find what it was. Thank you, my lord. Nothing but boiled water. Rice baskets empty. Mushrooms, half eaten. This must be it. I should tell Hanaoka. Did you find anything? Half eaten mushrooms. You fool! You know better! He must have eaten them out of desperation. I can make an antidote, but I need river moss. Stay with him. I'll find the moss.
My lord, did you find the moss? Here it is. Homeo, listen carefully. Crush this moss, add it to a cup of water, and bring to a boil. Have him drink the mixture, and he should be fine by tomorrow morning. Those at the camp need us now. Yes, let's go. Thank you for saving my son. You know, that man's symptoms were the same as the couple from the farmstead. Aching, vomiting, labored breathing. Symptoms of poisoning? You think the farmstead was poisoned? I'm almost sure of it. In which case, I'll need tubers to treat them. The moss was fine for that man, but tubers are stronger. They grow at a nearby pond. Let's be quick. Mongols, and right by the pond. Would you like to talk to them? Ask them politely to move? I'll leave this to your discretion, my lord.
Over here, my lord. You found the tubers? Yes. Thanks to you, I'm able to harvest them. It's just... watching you, I can't help but wonder if you enjoy the violence. I kill only to protect our people. I think about that every time I reach for my soul. Of course. I'm sorry, my lord. Let's go heal those who need it. it. Do you wish to keep going? Camp should be just ahead. Mm. Healer, my wife, she stopped breathing. How long has she been sick? Ever since the Mongols came by our farmstead. What did she eat? We had no food. Just water from the well. I'm sorry. She's gone. <gasps> <laughs> if only I'd gotten here sooner. You did your best. But maybe if I hadn't delayed, with that couple and that man. If we hadn't stopped, those people would be dead. You also wouldn't have figured out these people were poisoned. Perhaps. But I still don't know how. That man said his wife had nothing but water from the well. And we know people started getting sick after the Mongols left. They must have polluted the well. A contaminated water source would spread sickness like wildfire. But it's treatable? Yes, the tubers will see to it. Then help those you can. Thank you, my lord. You have saved many lives. Can't give up yet, boy. Ah! <sighs> 
fight me! Shamak Achturu Chinyabolna! I wonder if Sensei Ishikawa survived the invasion. Lord Sakai! Kenji, what are you doing here? Something has gone very wrong, my lord. What did you do? Nothing! The Mongols have taken all our food. Rice, millet, fish, anything they can lay hands on. We're starving. You say we. This isn't your farm. I have been thinking about what you said. And I'm trying to help the farmers here. Where the Mongols camped. Who knows, they show up every few days and pick up the food and cart it away. I could ambush them. It's not that simple. They've taken hostages. 
If we don't produce the food, it's... <gasps> there must be a way to find them. There is. You won't like it. I will decide that for myself. Come, I'll show you. They make us bundle the food and put it on the beach. All of it from this farm? The farm? Scavenging abandoned homes, fishing and hunting, just to fill the bellies of the enemy. What brought you here in the first place? Once the Mongols connected me to you, most places got too dangerous. I thought an out-of-the-way farm would be safer. Food and drink for the Mongols, but the sake barrel is empty. Your plan is to anger the Mongols more? Not exactly. The barrel is very roomy. It could hold a heavily armed heroic samurai. You know what would fit better? A flabby, flexible sake merchant. The Mongols will take the barrel to the heart of their camp. Who could do more good there? Me or you? I don't know why I keep letting you hide me inside things. Because it works. It smells like your breath in here, Kenji. Well, that barrel didn't empty itself. Get ready, my lord. Here they come. Mudigan uh, Pergendach. Yes, yes, all yours. Take, take. Faster Morigav. No, no, no. Uh, that's Miko. Uh, Miko is my horse. Mine. Nadamatat. More bignik borso. Ow. You can't do this. Miko, no. Kenji's plan actually worked. Negium Harsinta! Oh, shot, Turkey! Awesome, Zabu! 
Negium Hacinta! Take this food back to your farm. Give Kenji the good news. Kenji? Why would I give him anything but a punch in the mouth? What do you mean? He's the idiot who got us into this mess. He tried to cut a deal with the Mongols. Oh, Lord Sakai! That was amazing. Kenji! You suck his swilling piece of monkey dung! I'll handle this. Explain yourself. I might have sold the Mongols food, but given them straw and wood chips instead. To make a profit? To save the farmers' food. You didn't think the Mongols would notice? Mm, not so quickly. All of a sudden, it was punishment, hostages. Give us food or we kill you. I was wrong to encourage you to make yourself useful. What? No, no. No, you weren't wrong, Lord Takai. I can do good. I just need practice. Try not to practice when people's lives are at stake. Yes, my lord.
You're damn lucky. That samurai spared you, Kenji. I'm sorry, Taro. I was trying to help. You want to help? Choke on a rice ball. I can tell you don't want to talk about this right now. Goodbye, Taro. Set yourself on fire and mate with a Mongol bomb. Use an archer's help. Someone like Sensei Ishikawa. Heal! Saved from the battlefield by a thief. <laughs> what will my uncle think of you now?
Careful, my lord. This path is dangerous. Dangerous for a samurai, but not a priestess. What are you doing here? My duty, tending the shrines. When the war ends, people will need these Torii gates to mark their path, so they can find the Shinto shrines and pray for the Kami's protection. We could use their protection now. Yes, but the paths are too treacherous. I tried to visit the nearby shrine, almost fell to my death. Maybe I can reach it. As a boy, I climbed every tree and cliff around my village. If you get there in one piece, pray for our island, and take an Omamori charm for yourself. Wear it close, and the charm will change your fate. And perhaps the fate of our home. Thank you. Follow the Torii gates. They will lead you to shrines all across our island, and the Omamori charms that rest there. Quickly, cook it. Oh, <laughs> 
I wonder if Sensei Ishikawa survived the invasion.
I wish I had some company in here. It's been too long. Fight me! I thought you were Lord Jin Loku, but you're another samurai. Welcome, my lord. Another samurai? You haven't heard of Lord Jin Loku? He's a legendary samurai. I'd like to meet him. When will he return? Soon. Join us for dinner. Perhaps he'll share one of his grand stories with you. Back from 
my dangerous mission. Don't worry, I'm unharmed. Oh, I wasn't expecting a visitor. We're happy to have you, of course. Hmm. Thank you. Rai had survived. It was a fierce battle, wasn't it? The beaches of Komatsu ran red with blood that terrible day. We fought at Komoda. <laughs> of course. Forgive me. I'm tired from a long ride. Please, have Nabe show you the bath. We can speak more over dinner. Please follow me, my lord. you know of Lord Jinroku? He tells us everything. If it wasn't for him, we would have lost the whole island. When you met him, was he armed? He gave everything to save Tsushima except his horse. It's at the stables. My bath can wait. I want to look at his horse. I know this saddle. It belonged to Lord Higuchi. Jinroku is no samurai. I'll get the truth from him. Where is Jinroku? He left quickly after you went to the bath. I'll find him. We need to talk. Stop running, you fool! Stop! Before it's too late! I don't want to kill you. Stop! Challenge you to a duel. You want to fight me? Yes, it's the only way. If that's your wish, 
I accept. I don't want to die. I surrender. I'm sorry. Tell me who you really are. I'm nobody. I was just trying to survive. You're impersonating a samurai and bringing dishonor to the name. And you're taking advantage of those women. I know. Please, my lord, let me live. I'll never go back there again. Leave. And if I ever see you wearing that armor again, we will finish our duel. I wasn't hurting anyone! <laughs> Fool. I should tell those women the truth. Lord Sakai, welcome back. Jinroku wasn't the man you thought. He wasn't a samurai at all. Ah, he told you the truth. You knew he was lying? He seemed harmless, and we enjoy having him around. I hope you didn't kill him. He's alive, but he won't be coming back. I'll tell the others he left on an important mission. We were fine without him. We will be again.
Sup! 